right, Alex, thank you for that. And let's show you the, the fallout of the fires in Colorado. This is in El Paso County, Colorado, where firefighters setting backfires to try to hold back this blaze that erupted last night and currently burning six hundred acres. The conditions have been pretty poor across the West for months now. Red flag warnings in effect across a good chunk of Colorado, the plains up through Wyoming. We have fire weather watches in New Mexico extending up into Utah. So a poor fire conditions, a lot of that is driven by the winds that are really going to start to pick up this week and, and the, the hotter temperatures start to fill back in as well. The situation in the West, I feel like we show you this map a lot, and it doesn't change much. The fires just continue. 74 active large fires right now burning more than 4.1 million acres. All right, so I was talking about the winds, how they become a major player again this week. They're highlighted on this map. You'll check out the legend at the top of your screen. Anytime you see the purples, pink colors, even the dark blues, that's where you're starting to get some pretty gusty winds now, and that just makes fire spread rapidly. Really comes back tomorrow afternoon as well. It'll be a color. Colorado, Wyoming spreading up through Montana and Idaho, and then coming back in again, now spreading into Utah by the middle of the week. And then there's going to be a pocket there in Northern California where we see gusty winds as well. We'll call those the Diablo winds, as they're known in Southern California, be known as the Santa Ana winds. But overall, the trend for dry conditions, warm conditions, and windy conditions, very pervasive this week. You can see the humidity forecast here for many of us. Quite low humidities. This does not help the situation whatsoever. The, the fuels are already very dry at the surface, and now we'll continue with that, unfortunately, here, uh, Alex, going through you know, at least the middle of the week, if not through the rest of the week.